Mario forward smash killed like both blue team at 70. 70 yeah, dude, that was it like, sucks too, like that actually could have gone in the other team's favor. Yeah, they were working. Like, it was their two stocks at low percent to their three stocks at high percent, so they could have gotten a two v one really easily. Oh yeah. But here we are going into this set: Ganondorf versus Sonic, Professor Keats, and Greasy from Wisconsin. So Indiana versus Wisconsin. Oh yeah, we got a Midwest battle going on here, or Wisconsin Midwest, right? Yeah. As I was gonna say, that's what I thought. Yeah, we had actually a good, decent, like, like kind of like, a, what's it called? Like a, a punch bowl of uh, Midwest, or whatever yeah. you call it. Because uh, uh, I know we got Dristin from Missouri here today. He's a Bayonetta. I think, he, I think he's ranked in uh, Missouri. Yeah. Then we got a ranked Bayonetta from Illinois, ranked Bayonetta from Wisconsin here. We got a lot of Bayonettas. <laughs> ranked Bayonetta from Indiana. <laughs> yeah. There's, there's a lot of ranked Bayonettas. And we did get a lot of good turnout from Wisconsin, too, for, for being as far away as the tournament as it was. Even in Melee. Yeah, I think the final count for singles today is 49 entrants that feed into a top 16. Yep, yep. Ooh, nice down B, though, catching them. Sonic's actually at the, uh, the higher percent here. Oh, yeah. it'd, be, it'd be nice to just see Greasy just time him out. Just it, out of all spite, just play it slow. Don't don't rush anything silly, especially since he's got the lead. Yeah, that, was a smart uh, that was a smart recovery coming out of him, too. And actually, yeah, I think he's right now in the sweet spot of side B down, so kill him. Like really? He, he, it does, it, well, does it work on Sonic? I know, because I know it's like it's haphazardly like every other character it works on. So the whole cast has significantly different follow-ups on missed text. Uh, the Sonic does get a follow-up, which is down kill, which okay. will kill from a side B down tilt right now. Right now, yeah, I, I say I, it I, definitely. I know it has like some serious kill power. I just was always curious because I know sometimes it just goes through, like it has a very a special like frame requirement or whatever. Honestly, if I'm getting over, I'm just walking and uh, just spacing down tilt and forward tilt because yeah. they will kill. But now without the rage, I don't think forward tilt will kill from anywhere, but down tilt will kill off the top. Yeah. Oh, he no, actually got it. He got the he got the uh, percent Ooh. from the grab, but didn't actually get the grab. Sometimes that works too. Forward oh, air is gonna nice, do it. Nice forward air. Yeah, the the trade right there, the meatiness of that uh, fair. Yeah, super slept on move just because his other aerials are really good too. Yeah, it's just because it's it, up up air is like ridiculously good. Nairs can wall out so well, so it's and his back air is really fast. So it's like, why would I use fair? But it's so meaty. I mean, it's the perfect trade move in the air. But we do have Keats getting dared right there. Keats with the elite, so I'm surprised he's... They're both still kind of playing aggressive for it to be a Sonic uh, Ganondorf match. Yeah, we literally have two different extremes where, like, Sonic can time out anybody, and Ganondorf says really never to go to time. Yeah, so, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's really hard telling. Uh, <laughs> That's what I tried to do. Yeah, <laughs> I tried. But yeah, so. Sometimes you really want it. And uh, yeah, he learned from my mistakes. <laughs> exactly. He saw what happened. He's like, I'm not going to let that happen to me, too. All right, now Keats is playing a little bit more reserved, uh, realizing Ooh. he's such a high percent. I think he jumped, too. Oh, never mind. Uh, he jumped after. Uh, I was about so. to say, if he did, he still could make it back. But he's going to trap himself. Nice fair there, though, to send him across stage. Now he's got. He had oh, stage. No, he's done. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Sorry, buddy. I don't know why he went down there. He was feeling himself. Especially with the forward. It's so laggy. When you yeah. run off stage, up air or near, because you can just throw both of them out really fast. Yeah. I think both of them are like frames five and six or six and seven, respectively. Yeah. And near, near is just really good because it covers like the in front of you and then it'll, gimp, it'll gimp behind you, too. So if you drop with it reversed, you can just gimp them. Yeah, like the spatial of, it, of the move, front and back. And also the frames covers air dodges pretty well, too. Yeah. So yeah, that was that was uh, him feeling himself. But that was actually a really good set. I mean, it was only a three minute set in comparison to what I thought it was going to be. They were both really aggressive. Keats Keats kept going in, and uh, it actually Greasy had the advantage, uh, the first stock, all up until almost the end. Yeah, so it was a good showing in the first game. So it's definitely very capable of doing it. Oh yeah. I think Keats Keats might be seated second or third. In the pool. Yeah, in the pool. So. I think Crow's in the pool too. Okay. So I think Crow or Crow or Zimmy Smiles is what he's going by now. But um, he's first seed, and I think I think Keats is second seed, and I think Greasy Greasy might be third because I don't really see any other super notable players in the pool. So that sounds correct. But it looks like we got a Mario pick coming out. Now I know really? a lot of Mario don't like this matchup, but I know some Sonic that don't like it either. I'm of the opinion that it's not that bad for Mario. Uh, I, honestly, every Sonic matchup for me, I think it's just it's just on a certain different level. It's just bad. <laughs> like I'm just a s super big Sonic hater. Like people are like, yeah, let's ban Bayo, and I'm like, we still have Sonic. Like, <laughs> yeah, you think? Yeah, you're right. Good. Uh, but yeah, it, it, it's just it, it's a tough matchup. The only reason for uh, I think it's always a tough matchup for Mario is he's he doesn't have very good disjoints to deal with um, Sonic. Uh, he doesn't have any disjoints really. He's got those little stubby plumber arms, man. But. 
Plus, he's got he's at a super big disadvantage right now. I mean, almost 80 percent. At least with Ganondorf, he's he was winning the trades. You know, it's like okay, we both hit each other, but I hit you for 30. All right, let's see. Oh, he's, I thought he was gonna run out there with like a back air or something. Not bad Go for it. yet. Not pretty good ledge trump right there though. That was that's really smart from him. Yeah, that's what it is about Sonic. He's literally he's a hit and run character. He, he plays his own game. He's not playing Smash Bros. Yeah, he's doing whatever he wants to do for sure. So like again, like characters like Mario or Ganon want to trade, or yeah. like whenever they get in, they want to make the most of it. Exactly. Yeah. And he hasn't been able to get any grabs, which really off of uh, Keech, just because you know it's hard to get a hold of Sonic, which is a lot of uh, Mario's games. Whether or not he gets the grab and gets the percent, nice up smash right there though. And just like that, he's closing the deficit. Oh yeah. But back uh, throw's not going to... Oh, poor DI nice. choice? Yeah, I think so. Uh, sus DI, but that was, it was, it's still, I mean, Sonic back throw at 91% in the, the corner. Rage. Yeah, yeah, so... So, I mean, it probably could have straight killed, because it also doesn't move with it. Yeah, so. I mean, if we had 0.9 knockback, it wouldn't have killed. So that's the real <laughs> issue here. But... We're not in top oh, 8 yet, yeah, so we're, we're not in top that. 8. We'll have to fix that. But, uh, nice. He's got the stage control. Let's see what he can do with it, though. Keith's yeah, just going to retreat to the platform. Definitely a good forward smash for taking the stock. Uh, almost with an up smash, but now he lost the rage, so I think he'll need a little more percent for up yeah, smash. Yeah, it definitely won't kill yet, but he could kill off the top with uh, a down air, because down air sends up, and it's so strong. If uh, if he could catch him in mid-jump, or maybe if he goes to get... If he tries to spring ride, Greasy, uh, Greasy could get him with a uh, down air. Well, it's not looking like a bad Mario. It looks so clean. I, I was kind of skeptical. I'm like... Definitely always put your best foot forward, use your best character, but the Mario's not looking bad. No, he's playing he's playing the neutral pretty well. He's just he's not finding his options or he's not finding his opportunities to really punish Keats. Cause uh, I I talked to some Sonic main and I remember they were like every time they use spin dash, that's them asking for you to punish them. Like you just have to do it properly though. So you just have to know when you can punish and when you can't punish. Yeah, it's a matter of closing out the stock right now. Yeah. He's just taking I mean, he's taking seventy three percent extra credit. Nice dare though, but he didn't get the last hit, and I don't think it would have killed right there either. But nice up air, almost come off the top actually. It's kind of weird. Never really see that. Nope, well, he's fishing for that up smash. Definitely, I think it killed now. It's 131, but yeah. gotta be careful. Oh, nice spot dodge. Keeps playing the patient game. Uh, it's not gonna be. kill yet. It's a little early. Now I think it might it might kill, but it might be stale now. There we got Max Rage Sonic though with a number of kill options. That's gonna Let's do see, it. Let's see, that's it. So I say he's far enough to the side now. All right, so he's only got 91% deficit, which is pretty big, but not necessarily for Mario. I mean, he has the opportunity to get 40 to 50% on his first combo grab if he gets it. So if he just gets a really good grab combo, like an ally level or a Zinyu level combo, it's it's easily back in the range of possibility. Dropping shield. See, I don't know about that fair because it wouldn't have even killed. Maybe like Cape and Flood are definitely his comeback factors right now. Yeah. He's just got to play like he's still at 20%, you know? Whoa! That was some weird flood mechanics. He was spin dashing at the flood and it sent him straight up. That was weird. But nice back air there from Keats. You see a clean 2-0 coming out of Keats, but yeah. not a bad shot from Greasy. He no, still has a chance all. in this pool, but I think he's got to literally beat everybody else. Yeah, he's going to have to make sure he uh, makes the upset on uh, Zimmy's.